It is Governor Chukuma Saludo's Monday routine snap tour of markets and other locations to monitor business activities. And this time, he first stops at the scene of the Sunday bloodbath at Nipo community in Oka South local government area, where 10 persons were gone down in a court-related shooting. Inspect the trading activities at the AK Nibo market where the excited traders hail him for visiting them. The governor expresses grief over what happened to Nibo community and announces that the perpetrators must be tracked down. I'm going around Anambra to be sure we are all fine and to be sure you're all in good condition doing your trading activities well. I first stopped at the scene where hoodlums gunned down people on Sunday. I visited there now. We're crying. Anambra is mourning. These cultists that are killing one another, we are declaring a big war on them. There must be a solution to their evil. The governor departs, and the next stop is Umunze in Urumba, North local government area, where he addresses the youth doing communal erosion control exercise to uphold hard work and industry that Anambra is known for. Stop closing the market. Whoever that pinned another on the ground has also pinned himself down too. Do you understand? Whoever calls for sit at home should take it to the people he is talking to, not when one is angry, one locks up oneself in a protest. Such a one will die of hunger, and that's exactly what our people are doing to themselves. Addressing those at Unko Umunza market where it facilitates for the traders and even buy a few things from them, he tells them that Monday sit at home is evil. I came to buy tapioca only to find out that you locked up Nkwo. I have been going around looking for tapioca and I couldn't find it. We must end sit at home. Did you hear me? Next Monday we must come out. You will see security operatives at Nkwo roundabout and they must be patrolling every Monday to ensure the safety of everybody that comes out to trade. The final stopover is Nkwo Junction in Indemili North local government area where business activities are going well. The governor appreciates them for snubbing the illegal order. One day sit at home doesn't make any sense. Our people suffer. Your businesses suffer. The daily artisans and those who end their living on daily basis suffer. And there is no effect. As the governor departs, he says the monitoring will continue till there is total compliance and business boom everywhere in Anambra State.